Hey guys, it's your girl Vanessa here. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to share with you a simple DIY recipe that you can add to your regimen to help you increase your hair thickness, help to grow strong, healthy hair, and also keep it on your head. So if you're interested, definitely be sure to keep on watching and please watch till the end of the video so you get to see all of the steps and also instructions on how to use it. Now before we get into the video, I want to say a huge thank you if you are a returning subscriber. I really appreciate you guys. Honestly, thank you so much for your support. If you're new here, please consider clicking the subscribe button to join the family and let's hop right into it. So to begin with, you are going to need a mason jar. Next, you're going to have to need some fenugreek seeds. Now fenugreek is really good because it helps to slow down the ability of DHT to attach to your hair follicles. Now a study actually found that um, oil that was mixed with fenugreek seed extract actually helped to increase hair thickness and hair growth in an animal study. So it's really, really good. So after I added some fenugreek seeds, guys, I'm going in here with some fine cut hibiscus leaves. Now if you have dry hibiscus, please feel free to use that. It doesn't have to be finely cut like this or if you have fresh one as well you can also use it now hibiscus helps to stimulate hair growth it helps to condition um, the hair it prevents dandruff and itchy scalp it also helps to prevent baldness so it's very very good in that regard as well next I'm going in with some rosemary the very famous rosemary guys rosemary is really good because it increases the blood flow to the scalp and this helps to promote high growth and if you've used this if you're using it regularly you will definitely notice that your hair is starting to grow in both areas for example or starting to thicken in general it has anti-inflammatory um, properties which helps to nourish the hair follicles and it also helps to soothe and inflame scalp so I added some water and I'm just going to close the jar allow it to infuse overnight and then this is what we have the next day. I forgot to say the water is hot guys, but you can use cold water as well if you want to. So yeah, after I finish uh, putting the water, I just close the jar and just let it sit somewhere in the house. And then the next day, we're ready to go ahead and strain it. Now the jar was a bit difficult to open guys because the vapor caused the vacuum and it was a lot difficult to open so the trick is get a spoon and just press it around the edges until you hear like a popping noise and then you can open it so this is what it looks like the next day so we're pretty much ready to go ahead and strain it so the rosemary has literally changed color and also you'll notice that your fenugreek seeds have doubled in size or even more than doubled and that's how you know it's ready so just Pour a mixture on um, recap and just allow it to strain. Then we're going to pop it in a spray bottle so that it's easier to use. And this can also store in your fridge, guys, for up to two weeks, depending on your fridge temperature. Or like I always say, you can make batches of this and freeze and defrost and use as in when it's required. So stay with me in the next part of the video. I'm going to show you guys how you can use this and also talk a bit more about how often to use to see results. Now, if you made it to this point of the video, guys, and you still haven't liked it, please go ahead and give the video a like. And also, please subscribe to the channel if you're not already. If you're new here and you're into DIY recipes for high growth or maintenance you have definitely come to the right place so please click the subscribe button and also don't forget to share the video with your friend or family member you believe could benefit from it so now into how to use it so the way that I would use it guys it would be as a leave-in spray or overnight um leave-in spray what i mean by overnight is you can just spray it on your hair before you go to sleep just like in the evening when you're doing your normal routine spray it to your hair and then you know pack your hair as you would normally or wrap your hair as you would normally and go to sleep and you can repeat this throughout the week maybe twice or three times depending on how moisturized your hair feels or you can use it as a leave-in um a leave-in spray 
by just applying it to your hair just like I'm doing here. So you need to spray it to your roots and then throughout the rest of your hair as well. So um, make sure that your whole hair is saturated with it essentially. And then after you finish doing that, you are going to need like an oil or butter just to help you seal the moisture in. Now, you may find that this may not be quite as moisturizing as you would like for some hair types, and that's okay. So just remember to use, you know, um, maybe a short bought creamy leave-in conditioner that you can, you know, apply to your hair before um, going ahead to detangle and and stars you would normally really that's if you don't find this as moisturizing but usually fenugreek seed is really good when it comes to moisture and also the hibiscus is really good so generally this was just perfectly enough for my hair when it came to like you know giving it the moisture that it needed just like i said you are going to need like an oil or butter so i'm using my hair good butter here i've got this on my website if you're interested please don't forget to check it out is naturalvanesta.com and it will also be linked in the description box down below and also you will see products right below this video as you're watching so you can click on it to be directed to my website if you don't want to check the description box so that's what i'm using to seal the moisture in my hair but use whatever it is that you have available so after i did that i'm just going to use a comb and i'm just going to comb through my hair just to make sure that it is properly detangled and I'm going to twist that section and then I'll move on to the next section, repeat until the rest of my hair is completely done. Now, just like I said, guys, don't forget to use this twice to three times a week, depending on how much moisture your hair needs. You can use it even more than three times if you want to. Um, it just really depends on how moisturized your hair is throughout the week. Moisture is so important when it comes to just, you know, retaining length and just growing your hair healthy and, and strong. So it's very important that you... Uh, moisturize your hair as often as you possibly can so repeat that and also bear in mind consistency is key in whatever you're doing to be able to see results so don't use it once and expect amazing results you have to use it quite consistently to be able to see some significant changes so this brings me to the end of the video i hope that you guys have enjoyed watching and please if you did don't forget to thumbs up the video also please subscribe if you're not already and i will catch you guys in the next one thanks for watching until next time bye